Hey folks, Jiminy Critic here to talk to you about a movie called The Blind Side. That's right, you've heard of this movie, many of you have probably seen this movie, and I'm going to recommend that more of you go out and see this movie, The Blind Side. Let me explain what this is all about. This is a drama, not a documentary movie, but it's a drama, sport-related movie, brought to you by Warner Brothers. Um, it's rated PG-13, it has a little bit of language issues, and of course it's got to do with football and and other life issues, and I'll get to that in just a minute, why the rating is there. It's, it, families can see this, but just got to be careful about the younger kids. It's just over two hours long, and this is based, this movie is based on the book The Blind Side Evolution of a Game, uh, which came out, and this movie stars Sandra Bullock, she plays Leanne Tui, Tim McGraw is in this movie, the country singer, but he totally has a different look in this movie, just for those of you that are interested, the beard and the mustache are all gone. You kind of recognize him, but if you didn't know it was him, you might not know. He plays Mr. Sean Tui. Quentin Aaron, this big, huge guy that's, I think, just starting to be an uh, actor in some movies, plays uh, the role of Michael Orr, and that's what this movie's all about, Michael Orr. And then he's got, uh, the book was by Michael Lewis, by the way. Here's what's up with The Blind Side. It's a really neat story. Basically, this Michael Orr grew up in the slums and the rough areas. As he was growing up, his mom or his parents, I think, were split up and divorced, and a young black kid and his mom smoking crack and doing drugs and he's kind of fending for himself throughout his whole lifetime. Well the movie kind of picks up with him being about high school age, maybe 8th, ninth grade, 10th grade, and uh, this Tui family who are very well to do, Mr. and Mrs. Tui, Tim McGraw and Sandra Bullock, kind of find him walking around outside in the rain one day in the cold weather and ask their kid, hey, what's this guy doing out in the rain? And the little boy in the car, their son, says, oh, I know who that is. He goes to school sometimes. He doesn't have anywhere to sleep. And they kind of invite Michael Orr in to find out about him, to find out about his situation, to find out about his life, and invite them in to a loving, caring family situation. And this is where it really gets neat. He just kind of blossoms like a flower. Of course, he doesn't read well. He doesn't do school studies well. He's a huge, tall, big black guy, and they think they'd like him to maybe play sports, you know, to learn some discipline, to get some physical activity, and they think football would be perfect for him. Well, lo and behold, he takes to the game of football uh, like a champ, and this story just kind of shows how he blossoms in his life from a guy with nothing. And pretty much, by the way, this Michael Orr in 2009 was the first round draft pick by the Baltimore Ravens, and he's playing football right now in the NFL. So this is kind of a rags to riches story, but it all came about because of a family's love for someone who was kind of unlovable. So I'm going to recommend that you get out there and see this movie, a real life story about a real life family that turned out a real life hero called The Blind Side. Enjoy it.